Hi there. Welcome back to Tech It Simple. Today, I'm back with another video on how to log into RBC Express. RBC Express is a premium online banking tool, which offers online service that gives a control over your cash insight to your banking information and security you need to protect your business. If you'd like to log into RBC Express go click open a web browser first, and make sure you're connected to a strong internet before pick it in. If you're watching us for the first time, subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button and press the notification bell icon so that YouTube will notify you whenever we post a new video. Now in the address bar at the top type in RBC X, press login and search from the search results displayed on the screen, you're gonna click on this first link that you see it'll open up a new tab soon after you do that. Now, you'll end up in the signing area to RBC Express Online Banking, start by typing in your signing ID into the first text box that appears on the screen. If you'd like the system to remember your signing ID so that you won't have to type in next time you log into your account, click on this box right here. But remember to uncheck this box. If you're logging into your RBC Express with a public or shared device, then make sure to uncheck this box. So moving on. Now head over to the password text field and type in the password that is associated with your account. Make sure to type in the password correct but if you don't remember your password, you can click on this link right here it says forgot password and follow the instructions so that you can refer to a new password. You can also double check your password by clicking on this little icon in the right corner and move on to the next build. After you're done and typing your token number into the text box. You only need to type in the token number if you've enabled a two-factor authentication for your account. And finally, after everything's done, click on the sign in button and you'll be logged into RBC Express online banking in no time. I hope you found the video to be helpful. If it was go ahead and give us a thumbs up comment down below in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll be back soon with more tutorial episodes. Goodbye till